the, the, the main purpose is to get uh, the diplomatic corps and representatives from the foreign countries to come and see for themselves of what's going on uh, during this uh, festival. Uh, it's a very lively festival, the vegetarian celebration, uh, and also it's give them a chance to, to report back to their home country of what's really going on uh, at the beach, at the hotel, at the resort, on the street. And of course, they have seen for themselves on the flight. We have a full flight today, and uh, that's a good sign. Uh, so it's going to be uh, uh, an informative experience for them to learn from uh, uh, in, in Phuket, in Panga, and to, and to Kabi during these three days. But I gather over 20 were invited. Are you disappointed there's only, what, four, well, four or five here? Uh, it's, it's not very really easy to, to ask the uh, uh, ambassador of every country to come in, in the same plane. Uh, so uh, at least the invitation is out there. It's an open invitation. Uh, but we also tell them that uh, the schedule that I'm coming myself is today. So it's up to, to uh, their busy schedule as, as well. But yes, during the uh, upcoming season, I would assume that uh, many of them will, will take turns coming in. So you'll come again with them? Well, if I, if I have time. <laughs> Are you happy to be back in your job again? Um, as yes, I think it's uh, it's not for myself. It's for the for the sake of the uh, uh, the business uh, to continue to have the same policies makers, and uh, of course the same policy maker doesn't have to always uh, bring with to come with their own uh, their old policy, but they can can come up with more creative policies, and uh, the cooperation that has been about uh, from from all sectors can continue to carry on. Are you following up your meeting you had last time at the airport with all the tourism leaders here? Yes, yes. Uh, the tourism leaders are about to see me tonight at the dinner tonight as well. And uh, so that they plan to expand uh, the, uh, the airport here is, uh, is on ongoing. They, ex they plan to expand the runway and the terminal uh, in Suwanapum is ongoing. It's going to be announced in the government policies when they do the State of the Union next week. And going back to the ambassadors and their travel advice, are you? Is this main aim of this trip is also to try and change their travel advice to make it, say, not cautionary but welcoming? We hope. We definitely hope so, and I think everybody here do hope so to to see that happen. But again, uh, instead of asking them to to lift those uh, warning. Uh, we would rather want them to be anywhere they would like to see. And uh, the truth will speak for itself. So will they be given freedom to go anywhere they, they choose? Of course, yes. I have told them that the tentative schedule is just tentative. Uh, it's just a proposal. Uh, if they would like to see anything anywhere uh, or what to observe uh, uh, in any angle, we'll be ready to provide. And... Are you worried about lack of direct flights still to Phuket and, and Krabi? Um, you think that, can you persuade any more airlines to to have more direct flights here rather than through Bangkok? Yeah, I, I'd like to to see more of the uh, air carrier uh, coming into to Phuket and Krabi area, and we we believe that there are demands, uh, and the the air, airport authority of Thailand has agreed to reduce their uh, landing fees, uh, parking fees at the airport. And I think that would help the airlines executives to design uh, positively of coming to Thailand and, and, and down to Andaman. All airports including Phuket and Krabi? Pardon me? All airports? Those, yes. Those reduce yes. That's right. And do you know the latest statistics on, on, on visitor numbers? Recently they seem to be down obviously in August. But, uh... It has been a low season. Uh, it has been a lower of the low season in the in past three, three, four weeks. But we expect to see it picking up uh, in the upcoming month. Are you pleased the Russian ambassador or, or minister is here because they're one of the ones that are increasing a lot? Yes, yes. They are uh, emerging markets and we think that they will be the least uh, affected countries comparing to many other uh, older markets who have come here to, to Thailand because uh, Russia's Russian economy 
doesn't fully tie with the U.S. economy. And you're going to Pangna and Krabi. Anything in particular you want to assist or help those two provinces? Oh, instead, instead of uh, what I want, I want to, to listen to what they want and see uh, what they want uh, us to do uh, from the central government and uh, listen to what the uh, uh, market wants to see the improvement in those two areas. For example, Pangna has talked about wanting its own airport. Would you agree with that? Hmm. Well, building airports means a lot of money to be invest. Uh, let's talk about uh, uh, connecting uh, connectivities between transportation from the uh, 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 surrounding airports would be more uh, uh, effective, and uh, and we can see the the difference uh, faster. <laughs> if we are talking about building another airport, it would take about at least three four years before those will be happening.